Good morning and welcome to Journaling Junkie. Um, I'm here today to show you my uh, latest gothic junk journal. Um, this is done as a design team project for Art House Whimsy. Um, I've used quite a few of uh, kits to build up this. Um, what I'll do is I'll put a link to a shop um, on Etsy below so that uh, you can go and take a look. Our stuff is absolutely amazing. Um, so uh, what I'm going to do is um, give you a, a brief look at the front etc uh, and then I'm going to play some music. Main reason my wrist still isn't right and I don't want you to hear all the ow that's going on. <laughs> so I'm going to play some music and then I'll catch you at the end as I usually do. Okay, so this journal uh, which will be for sale in my Etsy store, uh, measures eight and three quarters by five and three quarters. Quite a tome, filled with uh, lots of grungy fabrics, uh, grungy images. Um, and I, I think I want to call it Abandon Hope. <laughs> um, You'll see when I start going through the journal, there are one or two little bits of ephemera that are my own, which I'll tell you about. So obviously they won't be for sale uh, on um, Tracy's website. So, okay. So, as you can see, uh, lots of uh, different textures. This paper, uh, there's some like calico here. There's a cheesecloth lace, buttons, uh, lots of sewing detail. Oh, guess it hasn't brushed the back. Sorry about that. Just take that up. It's done in a pane velvet, uh, which is really lovely. And, uh, it fastens uh, with this black satin ribbon that I've covered with cheesecloth scraps just to, to give it that grungy, grungy feel. Something a little bit different. I thought it went really well over the front, so there we go. And this is the beautiful image. Look at her little face. Hope the lighting's okay. Uh, I'm filming this. It's, uh, what time is it? 25 to 7 in the morning, so it isn't the best of lights, but uh, I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, so as you can see, that's the front. Lots of uh, writing space inside. There are lots of little uh, frayed bits. If, if they're not liked, they can always be clipped off. Um, so what I'm going to do now is... Uh, as I say, play some music and I'll catch you at the end. Thanks for watching.
Hi and welcome back. Well, I hope you've enjoyed looking through this journal with me. Um, one of the kits that I've used um, is called Coven Camp and this features the witches. Um, I love it because I just wanted to add a touch of whimsy to it. And um, so what I've done is I've fussy cut them out like on here on this page just bear with me fussy cut them out and added them on um it's a really lovely kit um lots of portraits in this kit you know uh lots of eerie pictures there's so a, a lot of uh journaling space in here um i have been asked to leave a few pages blank um so that people have got more writing space that is what i've done i've used textured pastes uh i love this one uh it was just the remnants of a die cut it was a heart shape and i just made a great little background for for this image um Please do go and check out uh, Tracy's uh, website, uh, Etsy store, should I say, uh, because she's some phenomenal um, kits that are, they're not just gothic, there's everything you could think of, and they're just so beautiful. This is another one of the, uh, from the Coven Camp, and I've used one of the backgrounds, um, from a page which I've shrunk down and then added this broom on there Fussy cut this out and added it. It just gives something different I've really enjoyed working with this Really enjoyed it um, One thing I haven't done As usual, I always leave something out as you know um, I haven't added in my little notebook that I usually do uh, so that will be included. Also, uh, there are a few bits and pieces left over. Uh, some of it of my own um, personal ephemera that I have that I will include. I'll pop it in an envelope um, to go with it. Anyway, that's it. We've come to the end. Thank you ever so much for watching. And I can just see that you're just getting a glimpse of my dressing gown. <laughs> I do apologise, but it is early in the morning. So, thank you again, and uh, I hope to see you all very soon. Take care. Bye for now.